Hey everybody, Mark here with my Apple Tech One Tech videos, and today we're going to do the app review on Wallah well, Screen Capture. Let's get started. When you launch the app, this is the main window you get, and from there you can take a full screenshot. So you just take a screenshot of your whole screen and click that little camera, and it will bring it up in that window. We can also take a screenshot from selection and we can choose different shapes. So I'll do a circle and I can do a circle like that. And then click the camera icon. And I can also have it as timed. And if I do an object, it will take a screenshot of a window, but since there's no windows open, it will just take a picture of my wallpaper and nothing else. One really cool thing is that I can take a screenshot of a menu item. So I do shift command M, it will highlight that menu item. I can move my mouse in there, click the little camera, and then it will bring up that in a, the window. And as you can see, I have that right there. I can also do a screen recording of a full screen or selection. I also get a web screenshot so I can snap something from the Voila browser. So I can just type in an address so we can do the Apple Tech One Tweet site. I can snap one right from there. I get all of the capabilities and everything as a browser. I can open my current URL in voila, and I can snap my current browser screen that is open. And the final option that you get is to take a picture from your iSight camera. For sharing methods, I can export it to iPhoto, email it, publish it to one of the services, or I can print it. Now on the left hand side, I have all my images, all videos, all images and trash. And we have some smart folder collections that knows where you took that picture from. And well, it goes beyond just capturing things. So I can actually edit stuff. So if I wanna edit this little menu picture I took of a jot spot, I can have my tools. I can do a selection. I can grab my pencil, draw on it. I have paint, bucket, sprayer, text, shapes, arrows, this whole bunch of different really, really cool things that you can add to your pictures. And I have to say, it is a lot like Photoshop in some ways. You can do a lot of really, really neat things with this app. So let's just open another clean picture and we can check out some of the effects. So I can do a spotlight. So if I want to dim everything else and brighten up one area to bring your eye to something, I can do that with the spotlight feature. I can also skew the image, which will change the way you actually see it. So you can angle a little more and get some really cool effects. And I really like the skew feature a lot. And then once I get that desired look, I can hit done in the flatten button. I also like the adjust, I mean the edges. So I can do a torn look for the picture. I can choose which edges it's on. And one thing I like is the blur effect. So you can make it look blurry on the edges. And it's just a really, really great app. We also have this item in the menu bar where we can do a whole bunch of different screen captures, full screen, select an object, select your menu, open your browser, record things, preferences, all this stuff. And if you haven't realized by now, this little menu image I took, transparent image, I actually took this in the Voila app. So anyway, this is an amazing app and I would highly recommend to anybody who wants to either take a screen capture, video, or just a picture of their screen. And it's gonna be great for app developers. If you have a menu bar item app like I do, you can take really great pictures of your windows and menu items. And I highly recommend this to anybody and I'd love this and use it every day. If you like this app, you can download it with that link in the description below. Thanks so much to the people who sent this app out to us to review. Again, I really love it so much. If you like this video, be sure to hit that like button. If you have any questions or comments about the app, be sure to leave them in the comment section below. And I will see you right back in the next one. Thanks for watching.